Unapona dalili kama vile kuhisi kwenda haja ndogo mara kwa mara, kutoa jasho jingi, kuhisi kiu sana na hata kupunguza kilo kwa kasi, basi huenda una kisukari. Kama una pesa, una chochote, si umepata depression ama umepata hiyo stress. Hiyo lazima itakuja tu na ujui kama imekuja. Newton Ngugi alipata kisukari akiwa na miaka 19 alipokuwa chuo kikuu miaka kumi iliyopita. Mine is a specialty type 1 diabetes which is quite rare. It's, it accounts for 10% of the whole demography of diabetes and it mostly affects youth of this age of mine below the age of 35. Eh? So I experienced quite a lot of challenges one of them being inaccessibility to insulin and medical supplies. Ilikuwa vigumu kwake kukubali hali yake. Living with the condition you are still in school one. So you'll find in a, in a school of around 1000 primary or high school you are the only one. So that is stigmatization. Secondly you are in for example in campus and all that there is peer pressure peer pressure means that you will start even identifying the vices of the society ila hatimaye alikubali na kuanza matibabu mara moja you need injection so the injection that you need is daily for example like myself i inject four or five times in a day so that at least whatever i'm taking can be regulated by by the insulin Kisukari ni moja tu ya magonjwa yasiyoambukizwa ila wengi wanaopata kisukari hawajui kuwa wanaugua. Diabetes is a lifelong condition so one needs to know what they need to do, how they need to live and how to prevent the long term complications of poorly controlled diabetes. And these poorly controlled conditions will lead to uh, I've mentioned amputation. They also um, can lead to blindness because it affects the blood supply in the eye can lead to uh, kidney failure because it again affects the capillaries in the kidney can also lead to uh, heart attacks and stroke because it does affect the blood the uh, blood circulatory system uvutaji sigara pia ukizidi kuwa chanzo shirika la kudhibiti matumizi ya tobacco yakiunga mkono wizara ya afya kukomesha matumizi ya tobacco nchini we are also encouraging members of the community also to support the government in, in implementing the tobacco control policies because by doing so we are going to see the diabetes cases uh, going down Takwimu za shirika la afya ulimwenguni zikiashiria kuwa kwa kila wa Kenya elfu kumi, watu 460 wanaishi na kisukari asilimia hamsini wakiishi na hali hiyo bila kujua Huku ulimwengu ukiadhimisha siku ya kisukari duniani wakubwa kwa wadogo wanahimizwa kuangalia afya yao kula vizuri na kufanya mazoezi mara kwa mara na kutembelea hospitali ili kujua hali yao na kuzuia aina yoyote ya kisukari. Robi Omondi K24 makala ya siha yangu.